Hey guys, a question I get asked very regularly is um, which snow foam I use. As anyone who follows the page knows, I, I, I pretty much snow foam every car that comes into the place. And I know not everybody uses snow foam, some guys use a pre-wash, <clears throat> um, a pre-cleaner like, out of like a garden sprayer sometimes, that, that type of a product, um, which some people find a lot easier to use, a lot tidier, cleaner. Uh, but I always like the snow foam, um, just because I had it a good snow foam to use I suppose um, but asking I suppose what type of snow foam that I use or that I recommend is not always the right question because every car is different every car I get through the door here generally will need a different type of a foam depending on what's what protection is on the car what type of a job we're doing to the car how much of a strip we need to do on it so we use pretty much everything from fully safe pH neutral foam that all it's going to really do is just sit on the paint and dwell on it uh, while it dissolves um, gently dissolves the, the, the dirt on the surface of the car right up to a full foaming TFR that we might use on something that is very very dirty and um, that we need to strip wax or strip protection coats off so pretty much every every car is different uh, I have one here at the moment I'll just give a quick walk around on this one one second uh, so this Mercedes was given a full job by ourselves and um, the protect and cleanse package a couple of weeks ago so plenty of wax on the car so when it came to a snow foam for this car we only used um, a very um, it, it's a very kind of light snow foam it's not going to uh, destroy the wax that's on the car we put down two layers of Meguiar's ultimate paste wax on the car so uh, we really didn't want to strip that off, so basically we're just letting the foam dwell on the car. Um, so once the foam has been left to dwell for a little while, we're just power washing it, ready for power washing now. It's actually starting to dry on it, which we don't want. But uh, yeah, that should, the dirt should just fall off that car now when we power wash the foam off. And it'll only need a very, very light wash then with the mitts and bucket. So if we had a car in that for example we were stripping this car we wanted to get the wax off of it we would use a much more aggressive mixture of snow foam and uh, which would take dirt and help to take the first layer of protection off it as well so always have a little bit of context when you're asking questions like if people asking what the best snow foam to use the application us knowing what application you need it for is it for maintenance washing is it for uh, stripping wax stripping protection coats off a car um, it always helps to have that extra info. Thanks for looking guys.